Welcome to Wounded. I've been sitting here looking at these things over our eyes for a few minutes now, so I think we should just begin. And you are Tim, a retired water polo champion. A few years ago, you were married to Andrea. A yeah, Andrea Andrews, a famous detective in the Atlanta Police Department. The reason for the divorce was your worsened mental state due to a career-ending neck injury and Andrea's obsession with work. Despite your separation from Andrea, your daughter Lisa still sees you often Often after the divorce. Andrea is fully dedicated to solving the Skinner, THE Skinner case. One of the most terrifying cases in the entire history of Atlanta. In the meanwhile, Lisa doesn't get enough attention from her, so she prefers to bond with you instead. One of her favourite activities is going on a fishing trip. The rest of the story is up to you to discover. We got a little fishing trip, let's go. Do we really carry that photo with us? everywhere we go now i'm guessing this is one of our previous fishing trips this place seems nice it's cozy we have a little fire fireplace going now i guess okay it's just because the door's locked uh, actually what was that little click i think i'm assuming it was the door uh, the bathroom i guess we should probably try and find andrea shouldn't we we should also put our uh, luggage in our room the door is locked i need it where why is the door locked where where could our daughter possibly be oh is it her birthday i guess it's her birthday tomorrow who lit those candles ghost now. she can at least be here on her birthday daddy daddy look what they bought me she wants you here Uh-huh, so I guess she had a birthday, but we, I don't know, I guess we showed up, but I don't know, we were thinking about leaving. Now, the question is, how old did she turn? I think she turned a whole 10 years old. She hit the double digits. Now, either it's just really windy, or I was right about having a ghost. Hello, swing. At least mow the lawn once in a while. You're home all day anyway. So I guess we just didn't feel like doing anything after the uh the injury a horrible tragedy after a long time takes place in atlanta a killer who murdered his parents managed to flee the place and escape the police by the looks of the massacred body it seems like he completely skinned them upon taking their lives a lot of knives and skinning tools were found at the crime spot the police is still uh on the chase with a f if they had that many tools and stuff would you not be able to get their like fingerprints or anything yeah, so I guess that's why she's still on that case. Probably need the fishing rod if we're going so, on a fishing trip. Dad, are you ever going to take me to that fishing trip you promised? Or should I ask again next time? Uh, we'll, ta we'll take you on the fishing trip. Don't you worry. I just need to figure out what I'm doing first. Another letter. Police reopen the Skinner case. The psychotic serial killer that skins the victims and injects adrenaline in their bloodstream is on the chase again. The police has a few leads and is working on locating the murderer. Meanwhile, several Pelican construction workers went missing while on a mission to fix a sewer pipe. Andrea Andrews, one of Atlanta's best detectives, is believed to be currently leading the case. I'd probably check out the um that sewer pipe if there's why are there so many ants and and flies, I guess all that fruit is rotten. Yeah, why don't they check out the, the sewer where all the people are going missing? We have not been taking care of ourselves at all. Oh, we got a note. Put the keys at some place where Lisa can't reach them. Thanks. Keys for what? We can have a little drink. Top quality whiskey. You want to be this for the rest of your life? A fucking drunk, you useless piece of shit. Well, here's our trophies from winning. Anything to I can do with it? Nope. I don't think I can move it around. I can zoom in, but apart from that, it's all... Hey, at least we've been able to keep the fish alive. You know, we don't care about our own health, but at least we care about the fish. Oh, shower time. Don't you think it's time, Tim? Don't you think there's something missing in our lives? I think we're ready. Oh, about having a... I'm guessing that was about having a child. Also, down the corner, it said three out of five. So I'm guessing we need to go to a certain amount of rooms or see a certain amount of things. Now, 
Now, what to buy? One kilogram plums, something of Pelica, Smoky, uh, five scratches. What happened to the mirror here? Why is there blood? I don't like that very much at all. Now, I really need to find the key for this room because I'm not sure where else I could actually check. Oh, the key was right here. I'm, I am so blind. I looked at it from this side. I thought it was just a shine, but it wasn't. Okay, the light over here. What is this? Atlanta Police Department and Manage... A few leads lately make me think that there's a connection between the missing sewer workers and my case. One of the bodies found floating near Dale Tanishore was poisoned by an unknown gas and had adrenaline injected in his bloodstream. By the looks of the physique, it seems that the victim was a physical worker, probably one of those sent to fix the broken sewers. I would say so. I was saying you should probably check it out if there's people going missing. Also, I like the jacket. I like the little stitch thing on it. Uh, and then I guess this is where she's been working on the case. Do you want to really just look around before we look at them? Which I don't think there's anything. So I guess let's just start snooping through all the evidence. Well, I have to take a job clean sometimes, Kim. Pillars never stop working, you know. She's, she's not wrong. I guess let's get on the computer. Nope, I can just turn the monitor on and off. Can I choose to do anything with the computer? i got to be missing something, because at the moment, my objective is still just explore the house. Oh, we can look at the fire. Oh, honey. 87 Cabernet Sauvignon. So thoughtful of you. We had this wine on our first date. You remember? Of course I remembered. Um, why is there something in there that doesn't look like wood? at all like right right there what is what is that there is something here as well Tim, what is this unfortunately oh, a neck injury we have to take you off the team i mean the least we can do is make you a trainer right tim come on come on tim get back here well they gave us a chance to keep working but i guess we just decided not to. Well, I guess it's night time. So let's have a coffee. What else should, What else would we do? Also, clean the coffee machine once in a while. Just... No, my coffee is brown. I was going to say, why is my coffee red? What sort of beans are you putting in there? I'm scared to turn around. Never mind, we're all good. Were those there before... I don't know if those were there before. I'm going to assume they were. And that I'm just seeing things. Anyway, let's sit down and have our coffee by the fire. I'm going to assume we're going to sit here or here? Right here. Oh, are we... I guess we're falling asleep. Maybe that's why we're getting the coffee, so we wouldn't. Oh, something happened on the fishing trip. It's not good. Not good at all. Why is it telling me I can run? I've been trying to run this whole time, and now I, I can only run now? The candles are out. No. Uh, last time I checked, I left the lights on in... Um, I, I'm trapped in the house. I can't leave. They're my lights. Never mind. They're not floating orbs. What's going on with the... Um... Hey? Can you please leave my garden? It's... Lisa? Oh, is that meant to be our daughter? Open the door. Open the door. I don't care. There's demons. Open the damn door. What the? No. No, please. Please. Not the fish. 
Not the fish! Oh, the fish are fine. Never mind. This is fine. Nothing to worry about. Um, apart from... I think we may drown. Maybe it is a little bit of a problem. Um, at least our daughter isn't going to drown. You know? At least it's us. Bye. Cruel world. No, the lights turned off. My daughter's a good contortionist. I, I'll give her. I'll give her that. Um, am I meant to be going somewhere, doing something? I'll just back off into the darkness, I guess. Now, please tell me that was just a weird, a really yeah. weird, really weird yeah. dream. We used to be a good swimmer, right? We should have been able to swim. Yes, yeah. we couldn't because of our injury. I mean, it seems like she was okay. I think it seems like she took us to the beach and I guess went to go get help unless something happened then. Anyway, there we go. There is the intro. Wounded. Hey, bird. How's it go? Don't you eat me. We're awake, which is... Oh, God, I don't know what you're doing. Good progress. Uh, where our daughter's gone off to... I guess we'll have to figure that out. God, he's taken such a long time to get up. There we go. Finish the prologue. Um, now, I guess th this was our bag! Our fishing bag! I guess first things first, should probably check out... Lisa, I guess this. Where are you? Right. Lisa! Can you hear me? Search Lisa! for daughter Lisa. Not just Lisa. Daughter Lisa. What is this? Her keychain. So she was up here at some point. And we got a little bobby pin. Hey, this, uh, her keychain. It's the same photo that we had on our table. I guess she must have gone up this way. I guess this... No, this couldn't be our boat, right? It's already filled with so much sand. Instructions. Bake it on 200 degrees for 30 minutes. I wonder what they're making. Or are those... You wouldn't cook beans at 200 degrees for 30 minutes, surely. Also, there are a lot of beans here. I think a, a lot of them are open, but I mean, if we need to survive on beans for a bit, we can. And we have the instructions for how to cook the beans. So I think we'll be good. Now we just need to find Lisa and we can tell her we have food sorted. And then we just need to figure out what, oh God. Um, I guess, do I just hit it? Do I just hit it at those points? Yes, we do. Okay. I can tell I'm going to mess this up while being chased. And it's going to go horribly wrong. But uh, for now, we're all good. Oh, why are there always just like random walkways? Every single horror game. I guess I have to give you a way to go. But you know what I mean. Why is there the bed bloody? Are you a colonel? A someone? I'm going to assume. I guess we won't figure that out. At least not until later. Um. Great, I love when things close behind me. That's lovely. You know. I could be wrong. Last time I checked, we were in a forest on the beach. What is going on? Why Why are we now here? Wherever this is. Anyway, I guess the turn on electricity. Okay, we're going to have to find some fuses. That uh, shouldn't be too hard. There's a fuse. Uh, we open the fuse box here. And I guess... Yeah, there's no electricity. Okay, that makes sense. So we need to turn the fuses on, and then we'll be all good. I also don't have a torch. Wait. Yeah, I've, I've tried L, T, and F. There's there's no light. Well, there's two fuses. Now I just need two more. I guess let's head up the fire escape, see if there's anything up here. Never mind, the door is locked. We need a key. But there is a fuse up here. I'll take it. Oh, and there was a fuse right on the ground here. How did I not notice that? There we go. That's all the fuses. Now we can come over here and flick the switch. There we go.
I mean, it turns the lights on for this stuff, but... Actually, I guess there's still a decent amount more light than what we were getting, so... I can't complain. My question is, what happened to the power? Because the motel sign was still on. So, well, what was that getting power from? Or so something is blocking the door. Okay, can I see what's blocking the door? Nothing is blocking the door. I, I don't know what you're talking about. Just just run into the door and you'll it'll open. Just a little bit stuck. That's all. Well, I guess we can check the tents and stuff that are over here. See if there's anyone or anything that will help us. We got... Hey. Who's there? Who's banging around? I have a tape and I'm not afraid to use it. Pelican construction. I, I don't know why this is having the thing when we picked up the whiskey pop up, but for some reason it was trying to play that. What has got my vision's blurring? What have I done? I'm so confused. I think I ate some bad beans. Or the game's broken. I don't know which one. Okay, I fixed it. I just had to interact with the pelican construction beans again. So we're all good. I mean, there's not really too much around, to be fair. We have a nice fire. I don't know who lit it. I mean, I heard someone banging around, so it'd be around there. And I guess there's no other way for us to go other than down here. Like, I have to hold crouch. It's not a tap crouch. Noted. Uh, another shed. Is this one locked? In this door we can break through, but the other one I guess we couldn't. We have a crowbar. And I think... That is all. I'm guessing, can we maybe use the crowbar at Big Ronk Motel? No. Definitely not. Definitely can't use it there. Oh, we probably use it. Lisa? No, no, no. I'm coming, Lisa. Come on. Use the crowbar. I, I can't check my inventory. Wait, we can listen to the tape, right? I can't hear anything. I'm going to assume I don't need that. Um, unless we need to go to the other door around here where it says something's blocky and we use the crowbar on this one and that'll let us get the key for up there or something. There we go. Come on. There we go. All we needed was a crowbar. Again, still don't know what was meant to be blocking it, but something. Now, are we going to get a key in here maybe? We can attempt signal. With that, I think down here. No, this decision will affect the ending. Oh, oh no! Also, the keys up here. So this game does have multiple endings. Good to know. So it seems like there's two things that affect the ending of the game. I'm hoping that called for police or something at the end. Anyway, I guess we're going into the f facility, whatever this place actually is. Where are you? Lisa, oh my god, what is can this? Can you hear me? Lisa! I can't. I, I, I can't do anything. I cannot. If I go into these rooms, it's just plit, pitch pitch black. I don't have a light or anything. I'm going to have to wait till I get a light to go through there. This does not seem good at all. That also looks like someone drew on the ground with a crayon. Oh, it's a piece of cloth. Piece of her shirt. Okay. Now, question is, what was actually going on at home with the place flooding? Was that just like we were dying and that's what we decided to see? Or... And this is like the present? Or is this like us reliving? I'm not a... Who's there? I had a controller plugged in and it started vibrating my table. Because I heard another vibration. I thought there was someone like right running towards the room. Okay, anyway, we got a note. Just finished setting up the lights for the first sewer pipe. We had to deal with a lot of issues such as gas, leaks, and rats before turning on the electricity. It looks like those things were chewing on our cables. It is good that our first problem solved our second one before we even identified it. That gas killed dozens of them, and now we have to dump rat bodies in plastic... Yeah, rat bodies in plastic bags. What a great Christmas. Huh. So was that gas from a person or was it why was it actually there and i guess that's what was going on down there i guess they, they were staying at this hotel while they were working on the uh i don't like that i don't like that at all but i guess they were w staying here while they were working on the um day the seven. pipe day Three seven days passed and i think i'm already going crazy i keep hearing sounds like someone's crying but it's muffled Probably just one of those stupid cats stuck or something. 
That's what they get for scratching all day. I just hope this day ends and I finally get back home. And why every few days something smells like burnt corpses? I hate this stink hole. Ah, uh, the favorite security guard. I love, I love Steve. But I'm assuming it probably smells like burning corpses because something like that is probably happening. I'm going to take a guess. It also is just so messy around here. Now we got to... You come in this room, I will hit you over the head with a tape. Don't you dare come any closer. Now we got nothing in there. We got another note up here, which I'm Being guessing I'll read. Security guard in the so fun. And those old wooden floors squeak like fucking mad banshees. It's gonna drive me crazy. I I just know. If it ain't the floors that'll trigger me, it'll be the damn cats in the supermarket downstairs. Them and their constant scratching. I bet they'd stop if they knew how old and moldy the canned food was. It's only been four days and I already hate it. Oh well. They pay. I stay. Uh -huh, so the cats are trying to get into the, um, uh, like the, just, I guess, canned food. Which, are they not, so, okay, something blocks that door. Why can't we just keep the crowbar we had earlier? Now, we got a key. Does that open this one? No, okay, I guess the key is probably for something downstairs. I guess, which I guess, time to go downstairs. Yay. Fun. Okay, we have an elevator, which I'm assuming isn't going to work. Okay, we have laundry 4724. Okay, well, we got a code for something then. Something's blocking that door. Can we open this one? This one just can't be opened. Key card. Can't put in a code. No. And this one's blocked off. And that one is also blocked off. Okay, well, what is this damn key for? Unless the key was for... It's key for this room, maybe? No, nope, can't interact with that one. But yeah, where was the key for then? Well, I guess there's not too much I can do down here. I guess we'll head back upstairs and see if I can use this key anywhere. Oh, it's for this! That makes a lot more sense. I guess we can switch the fuse into there. Does that maybe turn the light in here on? Yes, it does. Thank God. So that's how we're going to be able to see in here. I guess, what do we got? We got a screwdriver. We got okay. another one, day nine. The news about some skinning, butchering dude who's killing a bunch of people is literally everywhere. There's no avoiding it. And now the missing sewer workers from last Christmas are somehow connected to the case. I wish they at least finished their repairs before they disappeared. This entire shit stain, this entire shit stain is leaking fucking gas everywhere. I feel like my insomnia worsens every time I get near that manhole in the parking lot outside. What's wrong with people? Can't I watch something normal on TV? This job sucks. And then it's now your, so your favorite security guard, Steve. There you go. I like Steve. Steve seems nice enough. It's just he's not in a great, great work environment at the moment. Now, what would we use the screwdriver for? I guess maybe something downstairs. Oh, we use it for the locked door over here or the door where it says something's blocking it. I don't know. I just clicked on a random door and it seemed to work. Okay, at least we don't have to go back to the very start when we mess up. But what do we got behind here? We got another letter. This for sure. Locked myself in the office, but I can't access the cameras with this computer. I forgot my key card in the bathroom upstairs. Okay, that's all I need to get. Shit. It's the code again. It ends with a four. Fuck, not to mention the power's down. What the hell's going on? I have to make a run for the bathroom. Okay. It's only one flight of stairs and down the hallway. Well, we can't really do that because it's blocked off there. I mean, we could go back upstairs. 
But, you know, we're looking for our daughter. So we can't really leave. Key, I'm guessing that's probably for upstairs. I'm glad something's blocking that door. That must be what he th what that scratching noise is where he's talking about that he think is that he thinks is the cats, or something like that. Now, I'm actually gonna close the door behind me. I feel like we're gonna have to use this after we check out this bathroom. What happened in here? Also, oh, there's good old Steve. Was that Steve? Was that Steve? Was that Steve? Is it okay to come out? I hate how you cannot see anything when you're in those things. So you're basically just gonna have to listen. Please. I can hear him. I think he's checking out Steve. Just go. Just go. Just go. Just go. Just go. 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 4724. I remember the code. It's 4724 or something like that. Okay. Key card. 4724. It's not just... God damn it. Go. Go. Okay. Quick. 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 Change it. I get changed. Then wait for it. Turns in there. And now we go. I don't think he can hear us, which is really good. Very helpful. At least he can't hear us at the moment. He must have some blocked ears. I don't know. Anyway. Now the thing should be on. There's still no electricity. Well, I don't know what I'm actually meant to do to try and fix the problem. Because I've checked. I changed around the things over there. But that didn't fix the security card problem. Wait, you know what we need to do? We need to go into that room. That room he broke the door down of. Because he was in there. We need to check in here okay there we go quick close close behind me okay i can't close it behind me in this door right now okay Whew, this should help us a little bit this is what's wrong we need to find someone to fix fix the cables i'm sure if we just get some tape that'll that'll fix it right up uh there's also something up here it looks like another bit of our daughter's but no it's electrical tape perfect exactly what we need anyway now we can fix the cable Okay, it's just giving us a cutscene. I thought that dude was going to start doing... I don't know. Start doing something. What was that noise? Oh, great. Great. Is he downstairs now? I don't know. Oh, well, someone's... Why'd I do that? Why'd I do this? Why'd I go with the elevator? I'm so dumb. I am, I am so dumb. Why did I go into the elevator? I could have just gone under the wires, gone to the security room, and everything could have been okay. But no, I had to check out the body in the elevator. This is probably Steve. He probably stole Steve's body from the damn other place. Can I just go back up? No. No, I can't. Great. Great. This is, uh... I know you're there. I don't know how you ended up in this place, but I beg you to leave if you still can. This place is madness. I don't want to be Two here. Two different Pelican construction crews were sent here to, to fix the sewers and construct the upper floor of this motel. I was assigned for the motel part. Something awful happened. We were all aware the Atlanta City Skinner, but we thought that it's just a myth or an over-exaggerated police story. We were so wrong. So where are you? Oh, he's letting me through, I guess. Oh, God. The night he found us was Christmas. Poor people were sent here to work for triple the pay, but had no idea what's coming. Including me. The entire sewer network was full of traps and gas leaks. He and his helper Laszlo managed to set everything up before our arrival. How this did he know? The entire place is his playground. We couldn't even call for help.
But how did he know that they were gonna send people there? Oh god, I don't like this. He did terrible things to those people, and then left hey, them wandering. All of them have buddy, lost their going? minds and eyesight from the torture. They were skinned alive. This entire place is cursed. He took a girl yesterday and dragged her down into his hideout. We need her. That's our daughter. What will happen to that poor soul. That's our daughter, sir. Let me through! I need to keep an eye on him when he gets through as well. I guess I have these doors to make sure we listen to this dude. They don't know who the real enemy is. They'll attack anyone near them. They even attacked me. I was her crew leader for years. We were a family. I guess they maybe blame you for this happening. I don't know. But yeah, I'm I'm wondering if if I went to the security room, if I would have gotten a different ending, well, maybe. In the kitchen below, there's a microwave. If you somehow survive and get there, pick up the note that's inside it. Underneath that kitchen, there's a supermarket. I'm gonna with have to book it. I'm gonna break through note. that door or if that wall. If you pick up the one we headed to the shore, the last one is in the sewers. Pick it up and you'll. Oh, oh my God. What? It's him. Run. Run. What do you mean he's right there? The dude is right there. Also, run for it. Okay, quick. Okay. We're fine. We're fine. Nothing to worry about. Nothing to worry about. He can't crawl through vents. We're safe in here. Killers never crawl through vents. Unless it's like alien isolation, then then you might be a little bit screwed. Like a rat scuttling through the vents in the night. Okay, well, let's go. This room seems okay. Wait, where are we? This is just a different. Oh, okay. Wait, how? I thought the elevator went down. I guess the elevator went up. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, I guess the elevator went up. And not down. Anyway, um... It was... Four, seven, two, four. Uh, okay, it was seven... Four. I think I, 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 think I did seven, two... I don't, I don't know. Either way, I, I remembered it enough. Uh, we can call another thing again. Or try. Hopefully this gives us a better ending. There you go, decision will affect your ending 2 out of 2. So I'm hoping we get a good ending and that I actually contact someone. And we can watch a video. I'm guessing these aren't live. Or maybe they are. Is that? That's Lisa. We need to get there. I, I, where is this though? I can't see a thing. I... Lisa, hold on. Light. I'm going yes. to find you. At least we. At least. At least it's given us a light. Oh, why can't I grab the light? There we go. Ooh. And I turn it on and off. L T F. Okay, we can't. I'm just hoping that dude uh, can't see lights. Or I'm just saying, shouldn't the? Oh, the exit light is still on. I was gonna say, it. I'm pretty sure places are meant to keep certain. Jesus. Christ, certain lights on. How did you go through this door? The door is closed. As he slammed it closed behind him. There he is. I'm gonna go this way. And in here. And quickly run over this way. God. Okay. We've, we've found the kitchen. I was gonna say we need to get into the kitchen. Okay, we need a crowbar or something, or we can go through the vents. I think I'm gonna I'm gonna take my call with the vents. I feel like the vents are safer. I heard his breathing for a second. I'm gonna assume we didn't leave anything in there. And rule. You know how I said killers don't go in vents. I think I lied. I lied. Killers do go in vents. It's just 
most aren't psychotic enough to go through the vents. Yeah, let's go this way. Go, 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 go. Where are we gonna end up? Basement? Like a trash chute sort of the situation? Why does it look like someone's hung up by cobwebs? I've been helping him for a few years now. Who knows how long he's been here? I oh. the lesser of two Um Wait. No, this is a normal person. That's not the Skinner. So that person following me through the vent might not have been... Probably wasn't the Skinner. The first one that crawled across real creepy-like was definitely him, but... This dude isn't. Okay, successfully survived the chase and entered the market. What do you mean by the market? Oh. It's literally... It's literally just a grocery store. Okay, that makes sense. We're gonna have to get someone to open this, aren't we? Yeah, we're gonna have to get a crowbar or something, or a crowbar and then a key. Can I open this? No. It also shows we have a broken leg down the bottom. Or something to do with our leg. Okay, we got something over here. What's this? Uh... Oh, we can play one of the tapes. We haven't slept in days. And I don't even feel tired. What's happening to us? So I guess these are the um, people that work at Pelican. Sadly, I don't think they made it home. I should have listened to you. Money doesn't matter anymore. I should have stayed home with you and the kids. Ah, uh, so I guess he just, he only took this job because it paid, I think they said three times the amount of their normal jobs or something like that. I can grab the drill. No. Hopefully he doesn't come back here. See through the little slits here. Is that something? He turned around. He's coming back that way. Can I... Is that what I need? Use it! Low battery. Great. Great. Thanks. Thanks, game. Thanks a lot. Oh, God. There's a battery over there. Okay. Wait for him. Quick, quick, quick. Go, 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 go. Grab it. Grab it. There we go. Got the battery. There's also one more battery over there that I need to grab. I don't know how I'm going to get that one. I'm going to be honest. Go now. Go for it. 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 Grab it. And duck down. Duck down. Duck in here. I think we're good. Now I can watch to see his little, his little legs go by. And then we can go over there. I haven't seen the fourth battery, though. Uh, I don't know where that is. I don't see another battery. Anyway, quick, quick, run over here. Hopefully we don't need another one. We good? I think we're good. Okay, go for it. Boom. Boom. Jesus Christ! No! No! Leave me alone! Leave me alone! How do I escape him? What do I do? How do I escape him once he's already chasing me? Ow, Jesus Christ! What do I do here? I can't, I can't escape him. Okay, I think what I'm gonna have to do is we're just, I'm just gonna have to run. Go for it, go for it, go, go, go. And now we're just gonna have to, I'm just gonna have to go for it. I, I have no other option. I've been caught, so. Go! Open the door. Run, run, run. Just, just, just go for it. Thank God! Oh! There's a, there's a ladder right there. Not good. Not good. He can just he can just use the ladder to come down. Or if or it, you know, he's a bit psychotic, so he'll probably just jump down. Or not. Maybe he's just playing with me. Like a, a like he sent me in basically just in a rat maze. Now, don't go down. There's a door right there. Check the door. How did he get there? Okay, he's tackling me into the hole. I guess I don't have a choice, do I? I had a name once. I 
Jesus, I was just gonna tell me his whole backstory. It was a long time ago. Ah, fuck it. What's your name? I don't actually know. I don't actually know my name, sir. I'm gonna be honest. I don't know. I don't know if I just haven't been paying attention or if it hasn't actually told me. But yeah. Wait, was that him? Cause he jumped down with me. What's what's up? A pinky dislocated? I guess our pinky was dislocated. But yeah, did he jump down? He jumped down with us, so I'm guessing that's him. I guess he must have cushioned our blow for us to only have a broken pinky from God knows how long that fall was. Because normally, if you're up the top, you at least see a little bit of light, but it must have been... God, it must have been deep for us to not even see any light. Okay, anyway. guess we'll open that up. And... I, I think we must have been more hurt than we thought. Don't move. Hope he's like a like a dinosaur and he doesn't see you if you don't move. You know, T-Rex, stand still and you'll be fine. Or he just didn't see us in the first place. I'm not 100% sure. I guess it's good we tripped. Now, are there multiple of him? Because there was that other dude that jumped at us. Unless that wasn't him and it was just someone who, I don't know, attacked us for no good reason. I don't know. Now, this is the, uh, the sewer that the miners were in. Wait, do I have to get... Weigh this down or something for the door to open, I guess. Uh, I can't sprint when wearing a backpack. Okay. Oh, there's multiple here. But, yeah, I'm guessing this is the sewer that they were talking about because there's the gas. Um, I haven't actually seen any traps yet. But, yeah, I'm guessing this is it. Wait, what was actually wrong with this sewer apart from the gas leaks? What was actually wrong with it? I'm going to be honest, I don't see the problem with with it. I mean, to be fair, it is old and deteriorating, but what do you expect from a sewer? Okay, something's blocking this door, so we can't get over to that at the moment. Oh, yes, there's only one way we can go, isn't there? This is a heavy door. Oh, you can open the flap. Open the flap and see if anyone's on the other side. Well, there are people. Just not alive. Oh, yeah, we have a lockpick. And another note. So, apparently, we're getting paid triple if we manage fixing this hellhole before Christmas ends. There's no connection of any kind down here. So, I'll stick to writing these uh, things down on a piece of paper. We got a tape recorders as well. So, I'm going to try recording a few things. The gas leak suddenly appeared again, even though we fixed the pipes. Uh -huh. So, yeah, they were down here to fix the pipes. What does this say? I'm not sure. Yeah, so they were sent down here to fix the pipes, and I guess the Skinner was killing, I guess, sorry, not killing them, he was killing them, but I guess breaking the pipes after they were being fixed, so they'd come back down and come back down and keep doing their thing. Where'd he go? Is his body there? I don't see a body. I'm going to be... I think there is a body there. I don't know. I might just be blind. Okay, let's get this door open. There we go. Look how good I am. Just that good. And I'm guessing we don't get to keep the lockpick. No, we just leave the lockpick in the door. I guess good for the next person that comes along. If anyone ever comes along again. Laszlo's journal. Can we give it a read? I guess he's going to tell us. Oh. Or we play as Laszlo. I feel like I have nowhere to go. What else can you do when society fails you? There's no light at the end of the tunnel. There was none for my family either. So I guess he has In a, a chain wife of violence, my wife and daughter murdered by those who were supposed to protect them. It's been two hey. months, and every day I see the same image. The outline chart. And those criminals denying that they did it. So, why did you turn to a life of crime if you know what it does? Why is Laszlo deciding to help a murderer when he knows how it feels to have someone murdered? Understandable if he did it to get 
so, you know, he could target the criminals, but they did it to his wife, but he's not, it seems. It seems like he's just going for whoever. Okay, they this is our wife. It. The judge denied it, but I was there to see it with my own eyes. How can I keep on living when they bend the truth? They abuse our kindness. There's something about that detective that makes me hate society even more. Why should there be justice for them when there wasn't any for my family? Who's gonna bring back my wife? My daughter. Uh -huh. So I guess our wife was the one doing the investigation for that murder of his family. And then there's his journal. Back down here. Down his memory tunnel. I don't even think of following no laws no more. If they can't, why should I? I live off stealing supplies now, and I don't even feel like stopping. I do it for them, but it's not enough. This injustice has to stop. I need a plan. Uh, I'm sure there are people out there like me, and they can't do nothing. But I can. I can. He says he's stealing and stuff for his family, but would that would your family really want you to do that, Laszlo? Just a little bit of a thought by me. I don't know if your family would have wanted you to turn to a life of crime, but I don't know his family, so maybe they would have. Who truly knows? You can never say. God, this place is a maze. Letter? Newspaper? The Skinner case is currently being Living investigated in by sewer, Andrea Andrews. And yeah. it's difficult to keep track of time. Every newspaper has pictures of crimes that the Skinner committed. I steal them from the nearby stores because they don't deserve a penny from me. What Every did the shop owners do? I read bends the story, just like they bent the truth for my family. A oh, few years that. ago, I would be grossed out reading this. Now, I just keep on envying. The Skinner is my hero. I have to find who he is. Uh, so, I mean, I understand, the, I guess, maybe from stealing from the newspaper, not wanting to give them money, but it's still not them losing money. It's the people who are in the shop. So... I don't quite get it there, but anyways, I guess I don't want to turn that. I guess is the oh the door here is opened. Okay, but I guess that's why he's working with the Skinner, because he's committing crimes it he couldn't, something like that. And I guess I saw we're him. at the motel now. I saw him run out of that house. I lost track, but I think he went down in the sewers. Maybe it's his escape route. There's an abandoned motel right above the end of those sewers, but the way is blocked. Maybe he has a secret passage. I have to keep on looking. I'm sure he'll understand me. If he's hostile, at least I have this journal to prove that I did this for justice. I know there are many others like me. I know they'll understand. This system failed us all. Hmm. I guess that's why Laszlo is helping and working with uh, the Skinner. Which I guess he has his own reasons for doing it. I think the Skinner is just... I don't... Does, does, I don't even know if the Skinner has a reason. Or just because he wants to. Uh, what's this? Light. Okay. That makes sense. Well, I guess we go in the bloody tunnel. There was blood at the start of the tunnel. Which means something did get dragged through here at some point. The Skinner definitely came through here at some point, which I mean, the Skinner, he's honestly at this point. I, I refuse to believe the Skinner is not half rat. But the way he crawls around, he's got to be. A night torch can use, be used to clear uh, your path free, something or other, something or other. Dad, help me. I'm here. Please okay, stop. there's our daughter. We just got to get her out of here. Okay, you have to. Don't worry. 
Okay. We're gonna have to get some bags or something for up there. Now, what is this? Please, Dad. They're coming. Who is they? Okay. I found a, uh... Found out what the torch is for. Now, I'm guessing what we're gonna have to do is go through each of these tunnels and just yeah, throw the torch down it. So now I... Whoop! Okay. And now we should be good. I hope. And we're gonna have to reignite the torch. You know, torch can be used to clean your path of gas, uh, but keep your distance. Uh -huh. What did... Nothing's down here. Uh, how... Oh, I probably reignite the torch at the uh, thingy over there. Yeah. Don't you worry. I'll get you out of there. I'll get you out. Wait. She, you can, she gets out and then it just... Goes along a pipeline of some sort. Anyway, we just did that one, so now we do this one. I think there is something at the end of this one. Yes, the, this one does actually have a bag. So we'll grab that. And then we can't run while carrying this, so. Look, I'm 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 doing the best I can, okay? I can only go at a certain speed. Now we come up here and we pop backpack in. That should lift your thing up a little bit. Now we've done those two. Now we do these ones, so go. It's basically just doing this over and over again. And I just have to hope I get the ones with the bags in them. Which I don't know how many bags I have to actually collect. Oh, I just noticed we're also lifting this as well as hers. Okay. That makes some sense. Now, I'm pretty sure that's four. So I need one more. I don't think I've checked this one. Uh, I think I, maybe I have. Okay, it's down here. Yeah, further down. And throw it further in. Okay, I think I should be good. Because, yeah, it's basically... It was basically if you throw them at the entrance... Jesus Christ! I don't know why I feel like that scared me. But, yeah, it's basically if you... If you throw a thing at the entrance and it doesn't explode, there's no gas in there. You don't have to go, like, a certain ways in or anything. All right, now, she should be able to crawl through. No! no, no. Lisa! no! L Lou... I can't remember his name. It starts with an L. Well, I guess he's going to go after her. And I guess he is going to go after me. Which, I'm going down here. Which, they'd know where it ends up. They would know I end up here. Around that I need to explode. Also, who uses this? Slazlo's journal again. The beginning. Okay. Oh, let's, a little let's more go. than a week passed. And I'm in the hideout of the skinner. He doesn't talk properly, and he seems very impulsive. I showed him the pictures of my family, and he seemed to understand. He has an entire sewer pipe for himself. It's filled with traps and gas valves. Judging by his plans, he's trying to make this a death trap for the team of workers that arrives here on Christmas. Ah, I think I'll help him. This is a new beginning. The question is... This is my chance. Is how did he know about the people coming to work on the sewers here? Unless it was in the news or something. But if it wasn't, then I don't know how he knows. But either way, what is going on over there? It's, uh... Oh, I guess he's skinning some people. You know, the usual. The skinner agrees. He finds my ideas appealing. Have they turned the blood green? For me to find him. Is this my chance to finally get revenge? I can't think of that yet. It's time to start slow. I'm gonna show the Skinner that I'm worthy of being by his side. What's your plan? Or oh, our, our plan? We need to fight. We need to do something. We need to do something to get the Skinner's... More of the Skinner's approval. Which we're gonna, obviously, use a construction hat. They're all dead. The plan worked. I... I feel powerful. I'm getting my revenge. So we killed a lot of How the workers. I turn out this way? I... I can't think of that. This is all for my family. I'll show those pigs. If only I could trap that detective. Now that would be real justice. 
And then what after the detective? Are you going to keep murdering after you get the detective? I'd say probably. And at that point, it's not just... It's still not justice. You're just murdering innocent workers. The Skinner case is being investigated by the same detective who was on the case when my family got murdered. I just hope that he lures her into this trap. Then I'll finally get my revenge once and for all. For now, it's time to focus. We're building an empire, and I'm the brains in it. Oh, do they have multiple people work people here? Is that is that why there was someone who tackled me and then they died and then I don't know, a few other things now. I can't go through there. Do I want to see this person? I guess so. The skin of brought back Lisa. It is Lisa. I, I don't know whose child this is, but she reminds me of my daughter. If, if only I had my daughter by my side. This feels strange. It's like... She's the replacement in the void that I feel all the time, ever since the day they left this world. I feel so confused. Is she the salvation? I'm losing my mind. This injustice is driving me crazy. He talks talk a little bit with like, is she my salvation? But, uh -huh. So is he going to not harm Lisa then? Or try and stop Lisa from being harmed if he sees her almost as a replacement to his daughter. Rotten something him to survive. Oh, rotten feed him to survive. Well, there is some gas down here. I need to figure out how I'm going to turn it off. We need to find a nail and then we need to put a hole over here. Oh, or we could find a valve and turn it off. That would... You know, that would also make sense. I was thinking more if we put a hole here to make the gas spew out there instead of over here. But a valve makes a lot more sense, I'm going to be honest. Oh, we actually we are actually limping. Oh, this is the also the last tape I think I need. And this one actually has makes us listen to it. Was that a trap? Oh no, he chloroformed me. That's what it was. Never mind. I thought it was gas. We like tried covering our mouth, but no, we got chloroformed. I don't know why it took me that long to figure that out. Of course, it's a trap if it's chloroform. Now, does this maybe take us to where Laszlo was? Or, you know, Laszlo talking? We're home. Why are we back home? Lisa, I'll be there in a minute. Yeah, we'll be there in a minute. This should be a great oh, day okay, to go so on a fishing trip. Okay, so now we're going to be getting... See, so yeah, I guess we're getting ready for the fishing trip. Got glasses. Fishing hook. Uh, water. Snacks. We should probably grab our bag probably important to have oh we're packing everything in the bag okay flyers or the thing to be actually able to take the fish off hat i think that's everything plonk it all in there we go is that everything no not yet so i'm guessing if, what does this say try not to forget anything for the fishing trip i'm waiting for you in the backyard didn't want to wake you up uh-huh oh doggy and there's also another one here what to bring bucket hat Check. Sunglasses, chip, water, done. Pliers, bait, fishing rod, done. We need the first aid kit. That's what we're missing. Oh, the first aid kit is right down here. There we go. Ready to go. We must have done some redecorating in this place. Because I'm just saying, it looks a little bit different than before. Oh, there's another passcode. No, this is the same passcode as the one in the place yeah 4724 and then the key card again 
Favorite security guard, Steve. Jesus Christ. And then the... Oh, no, the, fi the, the fish aren't in there. I mean, it's good. I guess it's good that they aren't in there because that is not a great tank. Wake up. Don't tell me we're the Skinner. Surely not. I don't believe it. Also, another one of these things. Where you can... Try and call for help. Um, no, barely. Oh. That wasn't it. Also, what does this say? Uh, he took my skin. He wears my skin. Cool. I'm pretty sure it was 4724 though, right? 4724, yeah. It's been switched though, I think. So it's 4742. 4742. There we go. Okay. It was just so similar to before that I thought it was the same one. But no, it was just one number different. Now I'm going to close it behind me. And it'll be all good. Can I go in here? Okay. Can't open that up. Why are we going to the police department? To see our wife? Let's pull the fire. Nope. Why are we at the police department? Don't tell me we did something. I mean, we could be here for our wife, but I don't know. I don't know the chances of that. Andrea, you are more than aware of the current situation we're facing. Every officer we have, even the recruits are out there calling to riots down. Even you know that it's chaos out there on the streets. People are protesting in the name of Mr. Laszlo. And now you want to leave all that behind and assign a team to search for your missing ex-husband? We don't need more fuel in the fire, Andrea. We've been on the Skinner case for almost a year. We did everything we can. And it was all for your own good. This department cannot offer you more than it already did. Andrea, don't rush this decision. It will get everyone in trouble. Andrea? Andrea? Ah, God damn so it! So we went missing, and I guess she started doing a case on us. And why is everyone... Why is everyone riding behind Laszlo, then? Why is everyone deciding that he is is right? I've dedicated my entire career to this department. I've solved the largest cases in this damn city. And now you're telling me that I'll get nothing for it in return? My missing family's in question here. And even if it wasn't, who do you think you're talking to? You think I can't do whatever I want here? Last time I checked, Andrea Andrews is in charge of this department. Is that clear? I want to group up every officer available for the task or within the next two hours. I don't care if they're working the shift. I'm going to find my missing family and shoot the skinning psychopath myself. Uh -huh. So does she know that it was the skinning dude? And if so, I guess, how does she know? I guess we can't interact. God, flashing. I guess, let's just move on. Hey, buddy. Um, how's it going? Um, do I want to wanna leave? How's that sound? Probably for the best. Christ. Hey guys, busy today? I mean, I know I said I wanted everyone in here to look for the thing. You don't have to be so mad that I, you don't have to be so mad that I called you in. I know it was meant to maybe be your day off. You don't have to do this. You don't need to crawl on the roof like Spider-Man. Why are they all whispering about me? I don't think they're happy I called them in. Let's go on that search. Let's leave. Let's let's go search, guys, right? Right? Let's start the search party. <laughs> okay, we're out of there. Thank God. I swear I saw something down there. Wait. How did she get here before we... I am so confused how she got there before we did. But back to us, yeah.
Where are you taking me? It sounds like they have cells with, yeah, other people. Ah, they're taking me to the... I guess I'll just, I guess just the prison. Or whatever you want to actually call it. How many other people are there? There's at least one, two... And here another two behind me. So there's at least four of them here. That are alive. Wait, no, there's another one over there, so five, I think. Can I even look around? Oh, I can look around. A little bit. What is he do what are you doing, sir? Oh, I'm seeing his head. Uh, that one's blocked off. Wait, he could leave. He could leave if he wanted to. Okay, we're back to here with Laszlo. Was it Laszlo that... Oh, I guess it was Laszlo, not the Skinner, that, uh... That got me. I'm good at listening. You want to give your daughter a chance. You need to give me a chance. Do as I say. Do early. Do early. Oh, I guess he's... Is he going to try and use me... Get, uh, wife? We're up. We're up. What am I doing? We running? Well, he heard me. I would assume he would have... Is he deaf? Is he deaf or something? How did he not hear me stumble? Bonk him over the damn head. I grab that. I guess we're gonna have to come back and grab that. What is he doing though? Thank you. Goodbye. <laughs> I don't think I was meant to be able to do that. But I'll take it. Hide under the bed. Okay, let me grab that real quick. And under bed time. How is he not gonna think hmm, he's under the bed? He literally saw me duck down. Well, Lalo, Laszlo's been laid off. I can tell you that for sure. I'm so sorry, Laszlo. I mean, you're the one who decided to work with him, so... I guess he's leaving. Hey, Leslie, how you going, buddy? Not great. Oh, I'm guessing I was meant to grab the fuse, like, now. And, yeah, not, like, when I did before. Okay. Well, oh, that works. I don't have to waste my thing on the door. Now, this is going to be... I think this is going to be the last, probably the last section, I would assume. Okay, so that's where we need to get the fuses in there. And then I'm guessing we can probably go through that door. Oh, we are going to have to go down this way. Can I turn any of them? No, nope, can't turn the gas off with them. I guess we can go in here. And we can... Okay, valves. I guess just turn both of them. That turn... Okay, and then we need one more to be able to go through that one. Well, I guess we can check these two. We have news. Breaking news. Innocent mother and daughter murdered in a shootout between police and bank robbers in case led by famous uh, Atlanta detective. And Andrea. Husband demands justice right in front of the police station. Wait, was... Okay, this is probably about Laszlo. I'd say he's probably the husband. And yeah, so his mother and daughter got... Oh, sorry. His um wife and daughter got shot between, yeah, the, th the robbers and the police. 
Now, is he gonna read? No. Can this yes. get any stranger? I want to escape with her. Can I start over with her by my side? Will she ever replace my daughter? He won't let me. I have to think of a plan. Am I? Am I gonna betray the Skinner? The one who gave me shelter? I can't think of this. It's my own right to take back what was mine. Lisa is the replacement that I need. Why would you write this down, sir? If the Skinner saw that, he would have killed you and killed you on the dot. I mean, he did it before because you didn't kill someone. So there she is. Lisa, what room is this? I I, I don't know what room this is in. Who are you? Laszlo. No, no, no. Get away from me, Lisa. He let Laszlo. So Laszlo let her go. She ran back through the way we came. Oh, that's what he means by he couldn't kill her. I thought he meant the person in that room that we were in with. But he was talking about her. I'm pretty sure this is faster than the other, than what the other ones were going. Anyway, there we go. All four done. But yeah. So he let our daughter free, which is... I'm very happy about. Okay, we have our necklace. Are we going to take it? We're not going to take her necklace. My skin, I hate it. Must take theirs. The, the comments got under my skin, so I got under theirs. Everyone is something than me now. Uglier. Oh, so he didn't look like how he looked, so he decided to kill everyone else so they would look uglier than him, I guess. I'll make perfect suit. I will never be ugly. So he's taking people's skin to try and give him the qualities that he likes in them, I guess. Uh-huh. And I guess these are the faces slash... I guess they would sort of be masks that he's been making. And there's the last fuse. Okay, there we go. We got all the fuses. So come over here. Bang, bang, bang. This opens up. And... Oh. Found the valve. Can I please pick up the valve? There we go. There's also a letter. We're drinking tons of beers. Merry Christmas to everyone, I guess. I hope this money will be worth it. I wish some of my colleagues can, can say that as well. Everyone is acting weird and Ben cannot stop coughing after he went to check the pipes in the second part. Which, by the way, uh, we haven't even started yet and it's Christmas already. We haven't slept in two days. So, are they still going to be paid the extra money even though they didn't get it done by Christmas? Because didn't it say you'll get paid if you get it done by Christmas? Or is that just like the you should get it done by Christmas? Either way, with with whatever was going on there with them getting paid triple, it was, it was sus. Because they should have gotten the money before they started or gotten paid while they were doing it. Because if it's the Skinner that just pretended, hey, can you fix the pipes and stuff? They wouldn't know, had to know why he wanted them to fix it. I don't know. Anyways. I'm thinking it was probably him that set it up. Okay, well, that doesn't matter. I can still go through here. I guess we're going to have to be using the light again. So, going through a darker part. But yeah, hopefully our daughter made it out. I mean, we, should, we saw her running through the like jail cell sort of area, so hopefully she got out. Oh, unless the reason the mother saw her being dragged is maybe because is maybe because she got back up to the top and then he caught her. Maybe I'm guessing I want to look out for them. Can't go there. Now we can. <coughs> Wait, what? Oh, I have to press G to use the gas mask. I'm dead. Yeah, so that's my only guess as to maybe why the mother saw her getting dragged. Now, I guess we can press G. Put the mask on. Wait, we've been here before. Oh, we need to keep the mask on. So we can't take the mask off once we go through a gas area. Noted. Good to know. You know, I'm wondering, how is this mask working? It has holes. It has, like, two or three holes in it. 
How is the mask even helping? I don't know. Either way, we have one of the bags. Right, what else if we go back this way? Just say faster way back. No, I think it's about the same. What is this noise? There's some people are eating above me. I don't know. Something's going on up there. Anyway, mask on. Which we've got two masks down, or two backpacks down. We just need three more. Which I'm guessing two are probably going to be up the steps. Which I saw someone walk up the steps, so I don't know how I feel about it. And there's the third bag. Wait, I hear footsteps. Cool. That. There we go. I don't know where he is now. I can't see. Okay, he's heading up the steps there. Let's follow him, I guess. I need, I'm going to have to go upstairs. Which, this is where it unlocks the door anyway. So we are going to have to come back here. There's a bag. I'm pretty sure there's more steps over there. So I'm assuming he'll probably go down them. Yeah. I think he goes up here and then down them. Which I'm guessing there's another bag around here. Right there, I think, maybe. Yeah, there's, there's the last bag. Okay. He's up there, right? I think I saw some movement up there, at least. I'm not 100% sure, I'm going to be honest. Yeah, there he is, right there. So, if I just follow him around one more time, we should be should be good. Yep, there he is, heading down the steps. So, we just literally come over here, grab a bag, loop back one more time, and the exit is right over there. I'm going to wait to see him go up those steps. Okay, he's going up the steps. So, we drop the bag. And we should be good now. Now, you know what I don't get? If he really wanted to murder me, why wouldn't he just stay near the entrance? Just just a thought. You know? Serial killers and games aren't very smart sometimes. Uh, okay, I guess we want to look at these. Nope. Probably for the best. I'm going to be honest. Probably good we decide not to look at them. And just get out of here. Okay. Out of the vent. Which brings us to... I'm guessing this is above the elevator where we were. I'm assuming... Okay! This is the prison area. So... Yeah, this is where... We saw our daughter run through. Whether we'll be able to catch up with her and... Not... Wait, what happened to our hand? I didn't even know... Did we get, par did we get partially skinned? Just look at our hand. It's not looking... It's looking like one of his hands. Okay, well, first things first, there's a fuse here. So let's grab that. Now, this is a dude... Look, he could just go... Look, this dude could just leave. All he has to do is pull that a little bit, and then he can just... Leave. I guess they've just... I guess they just figured running probably isn't worth it. Now, I did want to quickly check something. I'm pretty sure they said, um... Electricity... Yeah, no electricity. Please don't tell me he's going to attack me when I turn the electricity on. Okay, thank god that door closes. Thank god. Otherwise that would've... Are you serious? He's eating someone right there. Okay, well let's... Come on, open this. Let's go. I guess the question is also, how long has it been since these people have had food? If he is resorting to eating another person. Then again, I don't know how long it's been since the incident with uh, everything happening in the mines. Or in the sewer, sorry. Seems like it's the way out. Yes. I see light. Light is usually... I think I got the best ending. Because I called the police like those two times. I think, uh, I think we've done it. Please tell me my daughter is safe though. Surely she made it out. Don't tell me they think we're the... They thought we were him. That's our wife, isn't it? <gasps> Thought I got the good ending. Apparently, I got the bad ending.
Well, that sucks. Maybe we're not dead. I was going to say, maybe if we called just one police, we would have survived. But it seems like we might live. Now look around. No. Nah. I still wonder, did the daughter get out? Is, is she safe? Because that was the whole reason we went in there. No, we did. I wonder if it would have been better if we just called one of the, uh, like, used one of the radio things instead of two. It might have been a little bit better. Or if we didn't even call them at all. At least the daughter's safe. Because she was there. What's she typing? Report, maybe? Detective Andrea, you're probably aware that the latest events in your Skinner case caused a lot more harm than good. I'm sorry, but they caught the Skinner, didn't they? You have my deepest condolences. However, the number of problems that your actions have caused in our city is putting our entire department in danger. The riots caused by the murder of Mr. Laszlo's family were already a huge problem, and now we have two new murder cases that include hmm. police officers from our department. Those who committed the crimes made sure that we pick up the message. The skin of the victims was gone, and praise the Skinner was written with blood around the bodies. I so hope the Skinner got out of there. The of the situation. Our team will be meeting you tomorrow for questioning. A famous Atlanta detective, Andreas Andrews, fueled up the riots throughout the entire city. Two more policemen murdered by an unknown group that made sure something around the scene. So the Skinner got away then. Oh, this is what I was trying to read. Made sure to leave the message that the Skinner is the voice of the people. In the latest news, we learned that Detective Andrea Andrews mindlessly shot her husband in front of the entire police squad in an attempt to save her daughter, but wasn't even in danger. According to the witnesses of the police department, she was in danger. What do you mean? For all the victims of her actions. Who's this? Don't tell me that's the Skinner. There's gonna be a second game? What? Wait, if there's gonna be a second game, does that mean you would die in every ending? If there's going to be a second game? Unless there's just one definitive um, ending that would continue on from, the, from this one. I'm not really 100% sure. I will end up probably doing all the endings for this game, but um, that'll be on my own time. But I'm gonna try and keep my eye out for the second game, if it, for whenever it's coming out or if it's already out. But um, yeah, I like the game. I mean, the story was decent. It wasn't really that hard or too challenging. There are a few little puzzles, but um, yeah. I guess I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, please think about like subscribing. It really does help me out. And uh, yeah, hope to see you in the next one. See ya.